Welcome to my booktube. <laughs> Sunday, February 21st. I'm having a super lazy day today. I don't plan on doing a whole heck of a lot besides whatever I feel like and those are my favorite Sundays. So that's what I have planned today. I'm currently chilling in bed with some of my cats. I have The Way of Kings which I'm hoping to continue. Surprise! Still reading it. I'm about halfway through. This I definitely want to finish this month and then I'd like to finish Becoming by Michelle Obama and start and finish Legend Born by the end of this week. So that's a little much considering I barely read, like I think I only read a quarter of The Way of Kings last week and then finished Harrow the Ninth. So that's all that I did. It's been very, very slow going. My partner is supposed to be going out of town for work this week. So he'll be gone. I will probably have more reading time then. I imagine. <laughs> but I'm also going to listen to one of my audiobooks today. I haven't decided which one yet while I catch up on some stuff on Animal Crossing. I just, I mean, I would love to have a day off where I just lay in bed and play Switch all day um, because I really want to continue with Skyrim and The Witcher because I have those on my Switch as well and I want to play them and I I'm still playing Story of Seasons. It is so cute. I really like that game. And my friend has convinced me to get Stardew Valley too because I've heard that that's great. So I just, I have too many things that I want to do and not enough time. Actually, that's a lie. With the pandemic, I've been given the gift of time. I have lots of time. I'm not commuting anymore. I'm here. I'm not working unnecessary overtime for free anymore because I've learned boundaries. That's where we're at for today. I'm just going to jump into some of this and I'll check in with you later. Tidying and listening to Becoming by Michelle Obama and I have only about an hour and a half left of that audiobook so I'm almost done. It is so moving just listening to her tell her own story. It's just it's so beautiful so I really like it. If you haven't read it yet I would highly recommend. It's just a beautiful story and especially listening to it on audiobook because she narrates it herself. That's pretty much all I did today. I did some tidying. I did some journaling, I planned my whole week, set up my bullet journal for the week. That's pretty much it. I don't really have a whole heck of a lot going on today. It is 7.30. I'm going to spend the rest of my evening reading Way of Kings and see how far I can get with that. And that's it. <laughs> so I will probably touch base with you again tomorrow. Hey, it is a Monday evening. I am editing my video from my vlog from last week because I want to have it up for tomorrow. Procrastination! I of course have left it until the day before and surprisingly not, procrastination is something that I struggle with because it's also my counseling homework that I need to do for next week because guess who's put it off for three weeks? I, I love that for me. <laughs> but yeah, I did a little bit of tidying when I got off of work and now here I am editing. I have a call with my friend in about 20 minutes because her and I usually do a check-in every Sunday night but she was busy yesterday so we're going to talk about our goals for the week and see if we're on track because we have weekly calls where we touch base on our goals um, just to keep us on track this year because we're determined to make this year so much better than last year. And then after that, I have another call with a different friend of mine that we have every Monday night and it's kind of like a weight loss group with her mom, her aunts, and myself. Because yeah, that's something that I also really want to change this year. It's long overdue. I lost 30 pounds over a year ago and then gained it all back 
pre and during pandemic so I can't even blame COVID for this one it's it's definitely my own bad habits I'm really hoping that this won't take me very long to edit because I really want to get back to reading the way of kings but I also really want to start legend born and I'm just really torn because I really want to sit down and continue reading the way of kings but I don't think I'm going to be able to finish it by the end of this month and finish legend born which I really want to finish before Elliot Brooks and Jesse May have their live show about it because I really want to watch it while it's happening and have already read the book because I never seem to read anything on time to participate in any of these things so that'd be cool if I could do that so I think I might prioritize that but I don't know if I told you guys my fiance is away for the week and possibly longer for work so I'm actually kind of excited to have the house to myself because it means that I can listen to my audiobook without headphones and clean and get a whole bunch of stuff done and it's gonna stay clean. I will clean a room and it will stay clean. Stoked about that. But yeah, so that's what I'm doing. I have a very busy night and I gotta get to that so hopefully I can read tonight too. Talk to you soon. I'm still editing my video. I have not been doing it the whole time. As soon as I was off work, I did a bit of tidying, I ate dinner, I sat down and edited for probably like 45 minutes, prepare the footage and create the little name cards for each day and the thumbnail and the end photo and all of those things. I was editing all of those. And then I had my weekly goals call with my friend, which lasted an hour. And then I had my 30 minute call with my other friend and her family for our little weight loss group. And then my brother called me because he's moving out tomorrow from our parents' place. Um, so he was excited to share that news with me, which was awesome. And then my fiance called me and I talked to him for another half hour after my hour conversation with my brother. And now I'm trying to finish editing this video because I want it up for tomorrow. And I don't want to finish editing it in the morning because it takes for freaking ever to upload sometimes. So here we are. That is my day. It's been a very busy Monday. I still want to change my sheets so that I have fresh sheets for the week. I didn't get any reading done today. I didn't even listen to any audiobooks. While it uploads, I will quickly listen to an audiobook, change my sheets, do my night routine, and then read probably just poetry for 10 minutes before I pass out. I'm tired. Work was a stressful time and this evening has been non-stop. So yeah, that's where I'm at. But no, it was, it was a good night. It was really good to catch up with everyone. I'm excited for my brother. It was great to talk to my fiance. He never talks on the phone for like 30 minutes. That is a, that's a really long conversation for us. Wish me luck on getting all of this done and getting to bed on time. I'll check in with you tomorrow. Thursday night. I just wanted to check in. I haven't been up to a whole heck of a lot today. I went for a walk after work and then I called my mom and I talked to her for like almost two hours. But I think tonight I'm going to listen to my audiobook of Legendborn and drink some more tea and then have a shower and go to bed early. I haven't decided if I'm going to continue listening to Legendborn and just like color or do something super relaxing or if I want to read The Way of Kings in bed. So we'll see. We'll see what I feel like doing. But for now, that's all I really have to update you guys on. So talk to you later. <laughs> Hello, it is Thursday night. It's, I don't know, like eight o'clock already. I'm doing a quick check-in before my phone dies. <laughs> Um, this week has been so incredibly busy. I wasn't expecting it to be so busy, but here we are. Um, <laughs> I have started listening to Legend Born on audiobook and I'm really enjoying it so far. I'm about a third of the way through. 
Um, I don't have too much to say. I really like our protagonist. She's feisty and she's really determined and headstrong. Um, and I just, I like characters like that. So <laughs> she's pretty fun. And yeah, this work week has been exhausting. I'm training in my new role and we've been absolutely slammed. So that's been really busy. And then after work, I've been mostly on the phone with people like all the time. My stepdad had a pretty bad fall on Monday and he's been in the hospital this week. So I've been talking to my mom because she's home alone now and so her and I are like talking on the phone and cleaning and doing stuff. We each have our houses to ourselves right now. We're enjoying the space and the time to clean without anyone else being around. We're both like, oh, I kind of miss our partners right now. And she's worried about my stepdad and I'm worried about him. So yeah, that's pretty much what my week looks like. I really want to film my March TBR, but I am running out of time and I have a lot going on this weekend too. And I still, I need to finish Legendborn and what else? Um, I was hoping to make some more headway with Way of Kings and read a bit more of that and a bit more of Crescent City, but we knew Crescent City was being carried over into March anyway, so that's not that big of a deal, but yeah, that's definitely what it's looking like is going to happen now, because it's, what, the 25th today? That's everything for now. I just wanted to come in and give a quick update, because I don't think I filmed anything since, like, Monday. But yeah, so tomorrow's Friday. Hopefully I'll film my video tomorrow, get started, because I have a lot of plans. Talk to you later. Hi Topher, are you enjoying my hair? <laughs> he loves to lay in my hair and make a nest in it, so I guess that's what we're doing right now. <laughs> hey bud, hi. I'm popping in for a very sleepy update. I haven't done like anything today. <laughs> And I'm already ready for a nap, so that's lovely. So I think I'm just going to read The Way of Kings on my bed and cuddle these cute kitties. <laughs> I forgot to wrap up from last week. So this is next week me. I ended up finishing Legendborn yesterday. I did like nothing yesterday. I was so lazy. I just laid there and like scrolled Pinterest and Instagram and stuff while listening to Legendborn. I listened to it on about 2.25 speed on Audible and it was really good. I finished the book probably at like 10 o'clock at night. Then I watched the live show with Elliot Brooks, Jesse May, and Jess Owens and it was really great to check that out. As for my thoughts on Legendborn, I really liked the story. I loved Brie as the main character, the exploration of her grief and searching through her family history, all the different types of magic. There's like three magic systems in this book and I just want more information about all of them which I think will probably be expanded on a lot more in the second book and that ending. I loved that ending. Semi-spoiler if you want to skip over the next 10 seconds. I love it when someone's overpowered. I don't care. I know some people don't like it, but I love it. So yeah, I really liked that. Um, no more spoilers. I need to start this week's reading vlog now because we're in the afternoon by the time I finally got around to doing anything today. So yeah, thank you so much for watching. Let me know what you got up to this week, what reading you got done, and thank you so much for watching. Have a great rest of your day. I appreciate you. I will see you in the next one.